What's up everybody, Jay the Video Game Guy here. Got another pickups video to show you guys. Uh, lots of really good stuff I found today hunting around. Um, one of them is a buy and sell deal, the other one is a thrift shop pickup, and the other big stack I got is the uh, local EB Games I stopped at once again. So I'll get you guys started on the uh, buy and sell stuff today. There was a lady selling some Wii titles. Um, she wanted five bucks each. Um, five bucks each or 20 for all, so I bought all of them. Um, I'll get right to showing you guys. First one is Chicken Blaster. And that one is complete. This looks kind of funny, it says on the back, play the role of a chicken farmer whose birds have gone haywire and save the farm by shooting these mad chickens. So, that one sounds like it might be kind of fun. Uh, Sonic and the Secret Rings. That one is disc only. Uh, this is funny. This game is called The Blob. Um, I've never heard of it. I have the one I picked up today from the lady on the buy and sell is just a disc only. But two days ago, I uh, picked this up from a thrift store here in town. Uh, the same game for two bucks. Paid five bucks for that one. The uh, disc is completely jacked, like someone had taken a needle or something and just scratched on the whole thing. So it's completely hooped, but this one is in, well, not great shape, but a lot more playable shape than that one. So now I have it complete, which is pretty cool. So actually what I'm going to do is switch it over to this case because this case has damage on it something has been jammed in there so probably just save that case and throw the artwork out next game was Nerf and Strike Elite uh, that one is complete and it didn't come with the Nerf gun but it did come with the piece that goes on top of the Nerf gun my dad has a Nerf gun so maybe I can uh, swindle them into making this complete so we'll see what happens there and last game I picked up from her was carnival games and that one is uh, no manual just like a little tiny multiplayer mode instruction and stuff and the disc so that was the pickup from the buy and sell uh, I was done there I went to their local thrift store, they were closed today, so I came back to town, checked the one thrift store here, nothing there. Headed to another town, uh, checked out their thrift store. A couple of sports titles for PlayStation 2, I just totally turned my head the other way. I uh, really don't want to pick that stuff up anymore, I used to just pick up anything. So I was just searching around, and they had a little section of PC games, and I happened to see this uh, sitting there, Destruction Derby for the PlayStation 1 in the uh, big cardboard box. This is really cool. This is now my first cardboard PlayStation box that I have. Um, and it's also complete. And that cost me two dollars. So that was pretty good. There's something on the back. There's like some glue or something on there. But for two bucks, that's really neat to have. So when I was done there, I figured I would head down to EB Games, see what kind of deals they got. Like I said before, a buddy of mine works there. He uh, tells me all the prices that are good and stuff at the moment. So what I normally do when I go there is head straight to their old stuff, PlayStation 2, Xbox stuff. And lo and behold, there's some more PlayStation 2 titles in. So I think I probably got the last of them. He said there probably won't be any more coming in. But uh, they said that a while ago and I just keep checking and I just keep finding. So I'll go through these guys and uh, show you. Uh, Kids Codename Next Door Operation Video Game. That was $4.99. And it is complete. Uh, Jimmy Neutron Boy Genius. I also got an edge card, so I did get the lower price on these, so this was $4.49. And that one is complete. Uh, I have this complete in box with the system 
and the uh, golf club that you swing and everything, but it was really cool to see the loose copy of it too, so I figured, what the heck, I'll pick that up too for $2.99. It's real world golf. And it's complete. Uh, this one doesn't have a cover art, but it looked like a pretty cool game. Conflict Global Terror. <laughs> I don't know why I'm showing you the front. It doesn't even have the art on it, but uh, there it is, complete inside. So, I don't know, I guess if anyone has an extra uh, box arts kicking around for Conflict, Conflict Global Terror, comment below and let me know. Maybe we can uh, do a trade or something. Next game, it is a sports title. It's Major League Baseball Power Pros 2008. Uh, I figured I'd pick it up for two reasons. For one, it was super, super cheap. And the other reason was... Um, it's not, it's with like these really little tiny guys on it, which is kind of cool. They almost look like Mii's from the Wii. So that looks like it might be a lot of fun. Uh, it is complete and for 49 cents, I'm going to pick that up all day long as long as it's not like an actual EA sports game, but that was pretty cool to find. And last game or last of the PlayStation 2 stuff. Every time I've gone in to check the PlayStation 2 stuff out, this game is at, it was at $32 the first time. I was like, no way, I'm not paying that for a PS2 game. Then I went in the next time, it was $29. Then I went in this time, and it was $0.99, cents, so had to pick this up. Lord of the Rings, Aragon's Quest. Finally dropped to something that I wanted to pay. It is complete. So... That was the PlayStation 2 stuff from there. I made my way around the store, checked some stuff out. Didn't really find any other prices I wanted until I hit the Wii bin. And then I found some good deals. Uh, Red Steel for $1.79. And that is disc only. Sin and Punishment Star Successor for $1.79. And and that one is complete. This has the precautions and the stuff in the Nintendo Club at the beginning. Sega Superstar Tennis for $2.69. And that one is complete. And the last game I picked up from there today was Rygar the Battle of Argus. And that one was $4.99. Complete. So, all around, uh, pretty good pickups for the day. A couple of things, just, it was really, really neat to find that PlayStation in game in that cardboard box in the thrift store. So, um, that's all the pickups I got for today. Um, thumbs up the video, comment below. Uh, let me know if you guys have a uh, art cover for that conflict uh, global terror game. So, subscribe to the channel. And uh, you guys have a good day.